today's November 5th. Is it really November? I have very fluffy hair today. And this is five things. Hello, Zane. If I had waited any longer to say hi to you, I wouldn't be able to gauge your reaction in person. Last week, I treated you to some hot skunk action. This week, I want to show you something better. Come here. Come here. Come on. Watch this. <laughs> Show off. I know. I know. Go away. You've waited for the results of the most important competition this year. And guess what? We won. Did you vote for a Tea Party candidate? No, I'm talking about the Super Note competition. Congratulations, Team Beard, on securing the trophy and stealing the title from Shay Carl. Several people I know, including my wife, filmed a Super Note for Wheezy, so congratulations to y'all, too. Do you say y'all now? I dare you to watch this without a big, stupid grin on your face. My fans are off the chain. But all these people want to do is find something to hate, and so they call me names. And then accuse my parents of chasing fame. Is that the best you got? You got lame. I had studio and get it. You just mad at the fact that you did it. Oh, sorry. Maddie B is a seven-year-old first grade rapper who is clearly, clearly very talented. He's blown up on YouTube in the past few weeks. Never been in the me, know what the Maddie B. Matty B's inspiration is his older cousin Mars, who writes and records his own tracks. I'm only seven years old, but I don't got time for your game. You'd have made a mistake if you think that I'm down for your heartbreak. Drop. The family jokes that Matty B begged long and hard enough that Mars gave him a shot. Check out his channel, Matty B Raps, or just go to MattyBRaps.com. I saw Conan during his last few months at The Late Show, and I instantly became a fan. I followed his rise to The Tonight Show, and I was really sad when they gave his time slot back to Jay. But that is all said and done now. You sure you don't want to complain some more? Conan's new show starts Monday on TBS. So we're going to do right now something that's never been done before, the fastest talk show ever. We don't have a lot of time, so let's get this thing started. Let's welcome our first guest. He's an Emmy-winning actor who plays Sheldon Cooper on the hit show, The Big Bang Theory. Please welcome Jim Parson. <laughs> So, Jim, how's it going? It's well. It's th nice to be here for yeah. Show Zero. Big Bang Theory airs Thursday nights at 8 on CBS. Jim Parsons! Check out the Team Coco YouTube channel for many more very funny videos. Conan's show will air Monday through Thursday at 11 o'clock on TBS. First week guests include Seth Rogen, Tom Hanks, and Michael Sarah. How should we... Okay, I'm gonna have my drink. Let's do this. What are you doing with that? Uh, I'm trying to figure out if it would be a good idea to microwave this. Um, let's leave that to the professionals. So Louis on fire right now. Um, yeah, this is also known as um, or, no, um, actually, gonorrhea. When it, when it burns when you eat, that's actually gonorrhea. Twice a week you can watch these guys microwave st Do not put that in the microwave. Twice a week you can watch these guys microwave sure. that people send them, often with quite explosive results. It's smoking. Oh, smoking is bad for your health, I know that. It, it must be... No, man, that, that's new. That's new smoke. I don't see why the thing would have just leaked. It's glass. It should have burst. It's kind of like Mythbusters, but with only one experiment. And no myth to bust. But they do always give you an answer. Is it a good idea to microwave this? You may be wondering, is it a good idea to microwave a Wii? I, I thought the Wii was stupid. Apparently it is blessed by God. God plays the Wii. So you may be wondering, is, is it, it a good, good idea to microwave, microwave a Galileo thermometer? thermometer? We're getting really good at yeah, this. I know. So, yeah, bad idea, because that thing is just awesome. You should keep that around. By the way, no. The answer to the Wii is no. Please do not microwave that. I'll be honest. I don't really watch The Simpsons anymore. It's still on, you know, it's funny, but... Every year, I do make sure that I watch The Treehouse of Horror, because those are always awesome. Sunday, November 7th. <gasps> You're a vampire! Let us move between the trees the way a bat does, by jumping. Don't miss The Simpsons Treehouse of Horror 21, this Sunday at 8 o'clock. You are gonna miss it. You work until 9 o'clock. 
And speaking of horror, if you haven't seen all five parts of my Horror October series yet... Wait. I can't... Uh, um, they're, they're all right here. You can click on them. I, I didn't realize they were just going to show up. I think I know how I can get out of this. Horror movies hate major chords. Last week when I posted five things, it took five days to reach 100 views. Five is a good number. Yeah, we like five a lot. But I like the idea of five hours better. So share this video with all of your friends. Your enemies, politicians, terrorists. Let's hit 100 views in four days. Think we can do it? Smile. Oh wait, I wasn't supposed to say smile.